Where? Welcome back. This is my weather, okay? Days of We've done this before. Or have we? Anyway, we gotta be feeling a young lady in front of us. So, what do we do with hookers? We give them $20 bills. Yes. And I'm sure she'd like to even score with us. Bam! I didn't think I was that effective. What? Yeah, I knew that was gonna happen. <laughs> Anyways. Yeah. You should never give women $20 bills, because they will feel very insulted. But, anyways, where was I? I was history. You know what I sh should do? I should move that way again. And that was a random encounter. Sometimes you will see her, sometimes you won't. And sometimes... We will ask the police what to do. Wait a minute. I don't think it's a big, good idea uh, to do that if I'm... I don't know why I'm seeing the police. Because remember, kids, the police don't know who you are. So won't bug them. So let's go this way, and... Oops! Yeah! Never fall into potholes, kids. Remembers your history. So let's do this correctly this time. And move the other way. See what's the latest news. Hey kid, what's up? But I wanna see the current events. Can you tell me what's going on? Twenty-five cents. Oh yeah, I love the news. Don't you love the news? Suspicious looking characters. That might be me. A description. Hmm. Yeah, I'm a funny person. Lies. So, let's see what's up in the newspaper. The Japanese bomb, Pearl Harbor. Holy moly! Those stupid Japanese. Ooh, look, it's a bum. Oh my gosh, she doesn't look like he slept in days. If it's worth 50 cents to you. You know what we do? We hit bums. So get on my face, bum. <laughs> Uh oh. You think they saw me? Yeah. I don't think they'd like me beating up bums. Ooh. I love gun places. It's Pete. Pizza Hall. Pizza Hall. Pete Sales. Nice wife beater you're wearing, buddy. Hmm, twenty dollars for a gun. It's about a quarter for each bullet. Hmm. Let's look at our beefy gun. Wow, I'm impressed. But uh eh, we might need the twenty for something else. You again. Didn't I teach you the first time? Ah. <sighs> Can't get rid of the bums. Just can't get rid of the bums. Oh, this is Peoria Street. Our address is like magic spells. Ah, two taxis. We can take the yellow cab. Or we can take the blue cab. But this guy is still in our way. So let's just ignore him for a little bit. 
back in front of Joe's bar. But there's some things in the inventory we should look at as well here. That's an office key, kids. Hankies. JS. Who's JS? John Smith? This car with several holes punched in the private. Sigil. JS. Apparently, I'm JS. Or John Smith. And anyway, since we can't get in the bark the conventional way, trust me, that key won't work. I guess we'll go down the sewer. And since we're in the sewer, we could gamble some more. Oops, I forgot which way I'm going. That's right, we're going for wine cellar. And I think I've gone the wrong way. Nope, I've got the right way. There we go. And our wine is still drying. That's some heck of a wine barrel. Anyways, let's go ahead and move up the stairs. That's the one place we haven't been so far. Some posters. Whoa. Psychedelic dude. It's like a hangover. Or being high. Okay, I wouldn't know what the second one would be. But, yeah. Who's this guy? Puff McMuffin. It's kind of like Egg McMuffin. Hmm. That's such a beautiful young man. Ace Harding. Must be my evil twin. My evil twin is a boxer. And who's this guy? Doghouse Raleigh. Hmm. Maybe I am Ace Harding. I don't know, maybe I'm Joe Smith. No secretaries. Why are there never any secretaries around when you need them? And I'll go ahead and take that, thank you very much. Yoink. I'm sure no one will miss it. And unfortunately, since we don't have anybody to call, prank a call, I guess that means we'll have to find out where this leads to, and I'm pretty sure I'd have to use a key by now, because this looks like an office. Why wouldn't you use a key for the office? Makes perfect sense to me. So let's see what's in here. Holy smokes! Who is this guy? Well, hmm. I don't know who that guy is. No clue whatsoever. So let's open them up and see what we can take from them. And don't ask me where. Oh, yeah, it's in the pocket. They did say that before. Hmm, is that the safe? And of course, they don't know the combination. Hey buddy, move the side. I gotta find out if there's anything in the desk. Ah oh, yes, of course. Pencils. When you gotta stab somebody in the eye. And we find another key. Yet another key. So, let's go ahead and hide the body and jump out the window. And once we jump out the window, there's fire, you escape. I wouldn't say no S, Sherlock, but this is a detective game. So technically, I am Sherlock. So let's move in here, and it's like a dentist room. Oh boy. And when we come back, we're gonna find out what the doctor has prescribed for us. Magma WK, signing off.